We're going to create an ortho image of a crash. First in scene, make sure that you're in a 3D view of your project. Go to the top view. Next, we want to make sure that we have a clipping box. And the clipping box here, we've called it main. It is our main picture frame for our clipping box. and kind of show you what it looks like. Now we want to go to apps. We want to click on orthographic photo, create an ortho photo. Make sure that the main clipping box is selected. We'll choose imperial units, show scale, and next we click on create ortho photo. Here it wants to know where do we want to put the ortho photo. I recommend putting it in your projects and in your project give it a name. Now this ortho photo we're creating so we can import into Pharozone 3D automatically to scale. So we want to make sure that our type is TIFF. Now if you're using another drawing program you can use PNG, JPEG, or BMP. When you click Save and then Create Ortho Photo, be patient. This takes quite some time in some cases depending on the size of your ortho photo. Now open Pharozone 3D. We'll click New Scene and choose Import Scene TIFF. We'll go find our ortho photo and bring the ortho photo in. Depending on the size of the ortho photo, this may take a moment or two. Once the ortho photo is imported, click anywhere on your screen and if you want, you can zero the X and the Y. Now we can zoom in to see our top down view. And just to test to make sure that our ortho photo has been brought into scale, we'll click on our scale bar and I'll zoom in here a little closer to see that ensure that I have clicked in the right spot. The scale bar is indeed four feet long. Now anything we want to measure on this ortho photo will be accurate into scale. For example, the roadway width. You can add symbols. We can add symbols to show how these vehicles impacted one another. And from this point we could complete our reconstruction analysis.